I want to thank Madam President Elise. She is absolutely amazing. And happy birthday. You look so good in your 40s, Nayral. Let me just tell you that. You know, 45 is the new 35. So <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. It is truly an honor to stand before a crowd of committed activists and world changers. You all work to empower women to drive their own destinies, and I'm grateful to you for selecting me out of many advocates who are committed to preserving the hard-won rights of women. Reproductive rights are truly a cornerstone of the American ideas of independence, autonomy, and personal sovereignty. And they are under attack. And we all know all too well that there is an extremist movement injecting a negative and narrow ideology into the politics and healthcare options of every single woman in our great country. This fight is bigger than reproductive health. It is bigger than insurance coverage. This fight is about the fabric of our nation. It is about freedom and the right to self-determination for all women. It is about the independence that our foremothers and our forefathers have fought for generation after generation. It is about what kind of nation we want to be. Progressives are working to build a nation where all people have equality of opportunity and freedom of choice. Americans deserve to live in a world where individuals have choice, a world where women have voices, a world where government doesn't issue a permission slip for, most, for the most intimate and reproductive decisions. And I'm going to tell you something, ladies. We don't need more executive or legislative daddies telling us what to do. We know what to do. So empowered women lead to empowered families, and that's our ultimate goal, helping Americans reach their greatest greatness. As advocates for freedom of choice, we respect the ability of capable and intelligent women to make their own decisions, and I will continue to fight for that, that respect each and every day as a public servant. And I, I truly want to thank you again. This is so humbling for me to be receiving this award for helping to empower power women. We are only as good as the next person that we help. And you know, Booker T. Washington once said that there are two ways to use one's strength. One is to push down and the other is to pull up. I want to thank you, Nayral, for continuing to use your strength to pull up women, to pull up families, and to pull up this nation. God bless you.